All right, guys, if you guys have a reverse osmosis system, oh, by the way, welcome back to Half Fast 719. We have this um, brand new, this, um, these filters are old, but uh, the new one we swapped over because this was old and this was old. So, um, yeah, it's hard to explain it, but we had... Uh, these things crack and leaking like crazy, destroyed our cabinets and uh, flooring. So I won't show you inside the house, but um, yeah, I just we just bought this set. I uh, used this was new and this was new, um, and we just replaced the filters. So. Uh, we replace the filters every six months inside the filters and then these every year. Um, and then I think one of these every year and a half. Um, anyway, uh, this is what we got. Just bought this unit. Um, I think it's a March of this year, January, February, March of this year. This is the APEC water, free drinking water. So this is your first filter, second filter, third filter. So sediment, all the heavy stuff, and then it filters it out more, and filters it out more, comes out, goes up to the tap. Uh, water comes in to these. So uh, this is the second set I have. Uh, we I threw the other ones away. Um, I did buy a set of this with different filter housings. To replace this one because this one is broken second time not even not even a year old um, I wish there was a date on these there might be a date on this but no 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 doesn't look like there's a date but this is our serial number so I'm gonna send this out to the company so I had to put our old bracket back on with new housings and new uh, whatever. I guess these would be the housings and these will be kind of like the manifolds, I guess. Um, oh, here's the date. That's when I put it on. Oh no, that was the last time I changed the filters for the old set. So, um, yeah, and then we just changed the filters on May and it is July something, so um yeah so this this whole system was was pretty much brand new uh we we just changed the filters in on january 22nd 2023 so a year and a half ago changed the filters and uh then we ended up having a leak and changed the whole system um april something like that Anyway, um, the old housings have uh, April 2024. So, um, yeah, anyway. Uh, so, I ended up using these because they started leaking. Um, these were the... So, maybe these are the old ones. These might be the old original ones because uh, January 2023. 20, because we just bought this. This system not this this was our original system because i'm a hoarder and i keep stuff just in case this thing starts leaking just in case one of these start leaking i can replace it um however whatever so anyway i'm a hoarder uh all right so second second time around we got uh, a lot of cracking here and uh it's no good so the first time was a lot worse than this one but my kid, because my kid's room is right behind the kitchen, and he said, man, it smells like cat pee in my room. And we went, checked under the sink. We have two catch cans. One of the catch cans was completely full. And uh, we have a tray that goes under our cabinet, and the tray was full of water. So anyway, you can see we got cracks crack there. Uh, we got a crack right there. I'm just looking at other spots. And then we have crack right there. So those cracks 
go all the way through. I'm not sure you can see it that good, but right there, that little black dot is, is cracked all the way through. This one, same thing. You got the crack all the way through. You would think that they're seams or something, but they're not seams. And then we have that crack right there. And you can see it's cracked all the way through. So, yeah, it's almost like these uh, NPT threads or whatever they're using for this. They're over tightening it and it's just uh, it's pushing out, I'm assuming, I think. So, I am going to figure out what size thread that is and possibly order um, on Amazon. They sell some stainless steel ones that are manifolds. They're basically just for, basically kind of like this deal. And, uh, yeah, so, that deal, kind of like this, but they have the screw holes and stuff. So, I'm trying to get the stainless steel ones. Because I'm sick of having water leaks and floor damage and uh, all that nonsense. So, yeah, there's all the screws. But that's what we got. I'm going to reach out to this company and let them know. Send them some pictures and be like, what the heck? You know? And, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to go from there. So, I just want to let you guys know. If you guys got one of these things and they're leaking you might try to crank these more because it looks like it's leaking from here or you know there or whatever um it's not it's not leaking from the seal some people they'll tell you to change the o-rings it's not the o-rings it's not the seals it's uh just cracked just cracked all the way through as you can see it's the second set um yeah uh but yeah so kind of sucks because you know that's our drinking water and then we got to go buy you know my wife drinks like a gallon and a half water a day so she probably goes through a case of water every day and uh oh kitty so anyway So this is the brand new setup we had. So this is the new new tank. New everything. I'll do this spider. Um see it's all it's all new stuff. New seals, they didn't get you new seals. Actually no, I ordered new seals because they told us to they told my wife to order new seals. We ordered new seals and it was still leaking. Um, but as you can see, I hoard stuff, so, um, yeah, so this, okay, so this was the original one, and this is what happened, so we installed it in 15, and then in, uh, 23, so January 23 is when it started cracking and leaking, changed the filters, changed the seals, and then we're problem solving for a while. So, yeah, you can see we change the filters a lot. Um, anyway. So, yeah, that's what we got. I'm going to call. Maybe I'll call this number and be like, hey, this freaking crap broke. Um, I did I did email them and let them know. It asked them if they have a stainless steel housing and uh, haven't heard back. So, I'm going to call them. And uh, go from there. And I guess I'll let you guys know uh, what happens. We'll see what, what they say or whatever. But all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment, do what you guys do. Let me know if you guys got had the same issues. All right, later.